So you might be trying to figure out how you can remove or delete an eSIM on your particular iPhone. Now doing this is actually very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. So the very first thing you're going to want to do here is you want to go and make your way over to your settings application. So you want to go into settings and you'll come into this particular page. Now when you do that, what you're going to want to do is you want to scroll down until you see your cellular connection option, which is right here. So tap on a cellular connection and this next page is going to come up. Now what you want to do here, which is very, very important, you want to go ahead and find that particular SIM card that you want to go ahead and remove. Now, some iPhones support multiple SIM cards. Some of them only support one. So what you can do here is find the particular SIM card that you want to go ahead and delete. So you can see right here, I have this T-Mobile SIM card right here that has a bunch of stuff inside of it, right? Now, if I wanted to go ahead and delete this, all I would have to do is click on Delete eSIM. So what this is going to do is it's going to remove this particular eSIM from this particular you know, phone. Now, if I want to re-add it, I'll have to you know, call my carrier somehow and then get my QR code and everything. There's also that add eSIM option at the very bottom. This is another very important thing you have to remember because this is going to allow you to go ahead and add another eSIM. Like I said, iPhones can have multiple eSIMs nowadays, so you want to find the particular one that you want to delete. You can remove it here. And that's the one option you have. But if you are rocking an iPhone and you're transferring to another iPhone, there's an automatic transfer feature. You don't have to delete the eSIM on your iPhone. You can just go through and just transfer your information to another iPhone via iCloud, and then it'll automatically transfer that eSIM too. So you don't have to go through and like, you know, delete it manually if you don't want to. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.